Folks, welcome back to uh, Professional Wrestling from Florida's All-Star Wrestling Extravaganza number 7. We are coming to you from the Garden Arena in Tampa, Florida. This is Dean Gordon. And our next matchup is going to be a tag team match between Hanabusa Smith and Charlie Pace. Hanabusa Smith, this is his farewell match. He has signed with the new Battle Arts promotion that is relaunching the, the revived Battle Arts over in Japan. He will be signing with them, or he has signed with them, I should say. He has been let go from his PWF obligations. This is his farewell match. He will be teaming up with Charlie Priest to take on Style S. Hiro Kazuki and Baba Nookie. So there you see, already, there on the icon, the Battle Arts logo. He is part of their crew. He's hoping to bring that punishment to the uh, roster of Battle Arts, and this is his farewell. Anabusa Smith has been involved in some good matches here at PWF, and he will be missed. And here comes Charlie Pace. We saw him at the last extravaganza where, where he really put a beating on the Hebrew Hammer, and he put a beating on Moko Loco. It was just bad. It was a two-on-three hand. It was a two-on-three hand match, and it was brutal. Charlie Pace is a rough, tug, rough and rugged individual. He is tough. Can you hear that music? Here comes that. Here comes the team now with Style S. And there's Hiro Kazutoji. Let there we go. We see the New Japan, the classic red and white. New Japan logo on his shirt. He does the strong style training inspired by Carl Gotch and Antonio Inuki. Calls himself the Gotch Lion. And here comes the Florida State Heavyweight Champion, Bob Inuki. Of course, the title is not at play in this matchup. That is why Bob is not in the main event. Otherwise, he would be. The main event for this contest, of course, is the big tag team matchup for the PWF tag titles. But look at him, he's got the gold around his waist. The Florida State Heavyweight Champion, Bob Inuki, he is a fighting champion. He is a great champion. And you can't help but respect this man. Tremendous competitor. We are getting ready now. 30 minute time limit. Normal rules apply. There are no special stipulations to this match. Charlie Pace now. He's hoping to make a mark. Hanabusa Smith has been involved in some tag team matches against the Power Squad. And to be honest, when Hanabusa Smith is on a tag team, he is usually the one that gets the win for his team. So we'll see if in this farewell match he's able to do the same thing again. Indian Deathlock by our champion, Bob and Mickey. Cannot take anything from away from Charlie Pace, but I'll be honest with you, I'm supposed to be impartial, but I am a fan of Bob and Murphy. Can he be beaten? Yes, he can. He's only a man, but he is a tremendous wrestler. And so far, no one has come along in PWF that can match him. That is why he is the Florida State Heavyweight Champion. He is the best in Florida. And if anybody from outside wants to come in and challenge him, I think he'll prove that he is the best in the country, if not the world. Bow and arrow lock right there. Hanabusa Smith comes in. Hiro Kazafuji comes in. These two lock up and already they're foregoing the wrestling and they are just getting into the striking. Big elbows right there. Nice move by the Gotch Lion. He uses, this, he uses the Gotch Special as his finisher. That is a chicken wing arm lock with the head scissors. Oh, look at that. Caught the kick and turned it into a dragon screw. Nicely done. Young Hiro Kazafuji, uh, Bob Inuki has taken him on, not just as a partner, but also as kind of a, as a protege. 
Hirokazu Fuji being mentored. Oh, but look at that big kick right there by Hanabusa Smith. And as he was taunting, Kazu Fuji came back with a big slap to the face. Now he's going for his own ball and arrow lock. Tagged in to Charlie Pace. Pace and Smith working well together. Nice, nice move right there. Both of them coming out the rope and now Pace with the knee. And here comes our champ, Bob and Nicky. Jumping Brain Buster and Charlie Pace spilled out of the ring. Bob and Nookie now gets some. He's uh, oh, he escaped. Look at that. But then Charlie Pace with his own counter, so he countered the counter. Nice move. Big punch right now. Both men just piling on each other with those strikes. Look at that. And bang goes a nookie, trapped now in the seated sleeper. Fights his way out of it though. Big elbow to the back and then an elbow drop to the back of the neck. Oh and now, look at that headbutt rush. Oh, that is just vicious right there by big rugged Charlie Pace from the Midwest. And Nookie, originally from Japan, came over with his family when he was young. And now there's an Achilles tendon hold at Franklin checking, but Inuki said, no, I'm not quitting. Nice arm whip by our champ, Bob Inuki. As Kazafuji now found himself countered, but look at that. And Hanabusa Smith got some game there. Look at that as Hiro Kazafuji helped out his mentor. And a big stomp right there by young Hiro. Nice kick right there, Hanabusa Smith. And he's uh, taking some damage. But he came back with a big takedown. And look at that modified sharpshooter. Well played right there. That's a good submission. Even though it didn't end the match, that did damage. And another big slap and a big kick right there. Big punches, look at that. And Charlie Pace. With the reversal and the brain buster. Well done. And now he's got his own sharpshooter. Bobby Milky. Trying to help out his tag team partner. Ooh, look at that big punch. Now he's introducing Charlie Pace to the turnbuckle. Pace still able to get his wits back at him. Nice snap there. Reversal right there by Bob and Nookie, the Florida State Heavyweight Champ. Inzaghari, there it is. But look at that. Pace just got right back to his feet. I haven't really seen that, to be honest. I've seen people kick out of the Enziguri, but I haven't seen anyone get up that quickly from it. Pace though doing a smart thing, he's getting out of there. All of the shoulder arm breaker by Bob Anuki as he focuses now on Hanabusa Smith. And the mounted elbow, look at that, just beating away on Bob Anuki. No respect for the champion at all. And a nice backdrop right there. Going for the cover. Bob and Milky kicking it to Hanabusa Smith. Look at those kicks right there by Hero. As both legal men are now dazed back to back to each other. And Nuki recovers and he's getting out of there. Tag back into Kazafuji. Hanabusa Smith with a nice big kick and now he's applying. He's not the legal man. Left himself open. He wanted to do some damage but he found himself getting smacked in the face with that big punch. These two fighters now exchanging blows, and look at the Hanabusa Smith, he tags out now. Double team coming up. 
Backdrop of Sophie Guitari combination right there. And a Boston Crab. Let's see if that will put him away. That's how a lot of the young lions end up losing when they first start off in Japan. The crab hole is seen as a test of endurance. Oh, Cobra Clutch. The Russian leg sweep maneuver right there. Nicely done. Back to the sharpshooter, Bob and Nicky now. Able to make the save, finds himself with a boot to the head. And a beautiful looking uh, spinning neck breaker right there. Swinging neck breaker. Once again, ramming the head into the turnbuckle. And a bow and arrow lock by our champ, Abenuki. Backslide, but not, that's not going to do any good. Neither man is legal. The action spills outside the ring now. Let's see what Hero's doing. Throws uh, Charlie Pace back in the ring as Hanabusa Smith is tangling with Abenuki. Big elbow right there. And there's a swinging neck breaker from Charlie Pace. Baba Nookie fighting out of it. Nice body slam. There's an Inziguri on Hanabusa Smith. Let's see if this will end it. Pace is going to be able to make the save there. And a nice reversal, but he's in the ropes. 18 minutes have passed in this match. We're nearing the 19-minute mark. 30-minute time limit, and look at that rush right there. Boncho rush, and Bob and Mickey is down. He is dazed, but he comes back with a snapmare uh, takeover. These two teams have punished each other, and look at this now. Double brain buster. And Smith right back to his feet, and here comes a dynamite punch combo. Look at that. Achilles tendon hold, will that end it? Bob and Nookie able to make the save. I thought maybe that could have ended it. Now Charlie Pays, big jumping pile driver, and there's the octopus hold. Kaza Fuji using the Manjigatame, but not able to end it. And there's another double team as we have passed the 20 minute mark of this matchup. Those are closed, pit, closed uh, fist punches that would have led to the disqualification. And look at that, he was going for that Boncho rush, but both Inuki and Hero are fighting for their lives in there. Charlie Pace got involved. Look at those forearms. Oh, but Bob and Nookie able to make the save. Whenever I see a move like that, at this stage in the game, you just never know when the breaking point is going to hit. There's a Dutch special, and there it is. It is over. Big win for Hero right there. 21-31. What a way to end this. Bye-bye, Hanabusa. Folks, stay tuned for the next match.